All right, I'm going to do something very different for this channel. I'm going to do an unboxing video. So stay tuned and see what I got from American Girl. All right, a couple of disclaimers before I actually start opening this. I apologize for the lighting. Um, I don't really have a good place to do this because this is too big to do on my normal craft table. It was either here or sit on the floor, and I didn't want to sit on the floor to do this. So this is something I ordered from American Girl. I think I ordered the 28th of June, and it came... I got the notification and been delivered to my post office box yesterday afternoon, which was July 7th. So that's how long it took to get to me. Um, I am clear on the West Coast, though, and they ship from Midwest or East. So let's open this up. Whoops. Missed the tape. Come on. Try and do this without cutting myself. American Girl always does a fairly decent job of packaging everything. There's always a catalog, and it's usually different than the catalog that you got in the mail most recently. So I'm going to try and oh, see my invoice even. Yes, it's one of the new Welly Wishers. Wishers. Welly, Welly Wishers. I was right the first time. Oh, I'm getting styrofoam peanuts all over the floor. I know the new kitten will have fun with those. There's my invoice. So I bought this. I don't know if they're still doing it, but they had a free shipping offer if you only ordered one of these dolls. Um, I'm not sure if that's still the case or not. So the Welly Wishers, if you're not familiar with these, they are 14 inches tall, I believe it's 14 inches tall, and they're marketed for the slightly younger girls, but the thing I like is, yeah, they're smaller than the regular American Girl dolls, and they look younger. So she's going to be integrated into my dolls as a younger sister. So stay, keep an eye on my blog for that. But I wanted to open this up on camera so you guys could see how they are packed, if, you know, if you think they're packed well. They usually are. I mean, nothing is moving. It's all wired in there. Let's see if I can even get this open. This is the problem with doing an unboxing video, is trying to get it open on camera, but I think it's important because I want you guys to see, number one, what you're up against if you buy, and also you can see if you think they're, they're packaged well enough to get to you. And I think they are. I've never had any problems. Okay, so that got her loose. We have little booklet here. Slip the tape. And this one is Ashlyn. I thought she was really cute. Get this box out of my way. So here's her little crown. She likes like princessy things. So she's got a little princess crown. So I get this open. Get her all unpackaged, and then we'll see what that's. She's got little things now. They all come with the little, the little rubber boots, or I believe they're called wellies. I believe in England, maybe Britain. I'm not sure where, but hers look like little shoes, and they're they're slid up the back. Nice heavy rubber. That's actually as heavy as a real pair of rubber boots. I'm gonna take these off so I can get a better look at her. Let's get her little hairnet off, if I can get a hold of it. There we go. And get that off of her. Okay, well she is really adorable. I love her face. I'll get some, some good higher quality photos than what I can put on the blog, for, uh, or on the video for on my blog. Oh, her hair is so soft. It's like satin. Oh, I love her. Now one difference between the American Girls and the Welly Wishers, you can see their eyes don't close, and they have a completely vinyl body. Now, one person I saw was showing that theirs, nah, 
She's a little stiff. I'm sure that will loosen up. I want to see the seam on the side here. Now my seams are, well, there's a little loose there, but pretty tight. I saw one photo online where someone had gotten one and the gap in here was really big, but that's not. That's, that looks fine. Oh, I am looking really forward to not only doing some Allison's Journal blogs with her in the storyline, but also just sewing for this other size. I think this is going to be fun, and she is adorable. Oh, my goodness. She is so cute. Let's see what this is. Sticking to the tape. Okay, it looks like this is a little, little bit about meeting them and shows a picture of all the different girls. I'll put a link in the blog post to the uh, to the dolls on the American Girl website too for you so you can find them. And that is really cute. I'm really happy with the purchase. Oh, and she was, I think she was $60, and like I said, shipping was free if I bought her, so that's not too bad. A lot cheaper than the American Girl dolls, which have gotten really expensive at over $100 each, so she is so cute. Now the joints are kind of stiff, but oh yeah, it's loosening up already. So that is the newest member of our doll family. Uh, be sure and hop over to the blog, like I said, for the links and for some better photos, and I made her a few clothes. If they fit, I'll take some pictures of her not only in this outfit, but in the outfits I made. So thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later. Bye.